hippies love frisbees. So how about we give her a, a few complimentary frisbees? <laughs> now that I think about it, probably should have put these in the trunk and not in her engine, but it, it'll be, it'll be fine. It'll, it'll, everything is fine. Everything is fine. Guys, calm down. <laughs> What's up, guys, and welcome back to Job Simulator. Now, over the past few episodes, we've been doing some pretty good work here as an auto mechanic, but I feel like we could do better, or we could do more for people. So for today's episode, I wanted to kick off a brand new guarantee here at Grifty Loop and that every customer that comes through that door is gonna leave with more than they bargained for. And hopefully that means somebody will take Job Bot because I still freaking hate that guy. People actually commented last episode saying that calling HR on JobBot's behavior might not really do anything. Because HR is human resources. And you're not human, so you, you best watch out, okay? I'm gonna call S R R stupid robot resources. They'll get your ass fired for sexual harassment. What the hell? Okay. So I was racing, super fast as usual, and out of nowhere, there was all this oil and debris, and I spun out, and my car's all messed up now, so, so what's the deal? Can you help me or what? <laughs> okay, just, just, just slow down. Ahead. Just slow down. God, it's Speed Racer. <laughs> right, go. Speed Racer. Na, 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 na. Speed Racer. Oh, wait, that's Grease Lightning. How did Speed Racer go? I guess technically Speed Racer didn't go. That's why she brought the car here, right? 404. Problem not found. Lady, your engine looks fine. I don't see any- Oh, you want tires! Why didn't you just say so? Okay, left front. We're gonna go down to tires. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be a bit of a problem. The best we got, human. These racing types are always willing to shell out the money for the top brands. I don't think we get paid on brands, dude. If you're gonna scam people, you should know that all I have to do is put on any tire and take as long as possible and we'll be perfectly fine. I don't suppose you would want to specify which brand is the best brand? No? You're just gonna keep staring at my ass as I work? Alright, that's cool. I would guess that it goes from worst to best, because we have stone, and then I think this one has a patch sewn onto it, then wood, they get a little bit better, so you're probably as good as it's gonna get, right? Oh, those are classic. Yeah, classic is probably expensive. What is it with the villains of all of these shows race and dirty? Like, why couldn't they just get good rather than throwing caltrops, right? <laughs> Doesn't seem very fair at all, so I'm just gonna put that final tire on. Okay, maybe that'll work, but I feel like we could go even faster. Uh, could you load up the 404 with some turbo knobs? The fastest you got. Or right in there. Let's do this. Come on, let's go. Have you been drinking Turbo Nos? Turbo Nos, huh? We're gonna pour in some Turbo Nos. Uh, okay. I don't think I've done. Oh, the energy drink is Turbo Nos. No wonder it causes seizures in humans. I've been drinking it this entire time. I mean, it doesn't taste like Turbo Nos. It tastes like Mountain Dew, which probably tastes like Turbo Nos. If it can kill your sperm, it can probably kill your brain cells. So let's just give you a sip here, Speed Racer. That should probably be good enough, right? No? Oh, I need to shake it up right. I forgot about that. So now we're turbo. All right, hold on. Let's get that old fluid out. Yeah, we don't want any of that Mountain Dew junk. We're, we're going code red. <laughs> there we go. That should make you go fast. Just like Sanic. Is this not what? Oh, it doesn't go in here. It goes in. Oh my God, I'm screwing everything up. Why would Nos go in the gas tank? <laughs> All right. Well, I'm just gonna say that this is a part of my new guarantee, right? Leave with more than you wanted. She only wanted a little bit in the... In the gas tank. Whoa. Okay, that that's pretty intense. We, we gotta take a quick look at that. Just don't... Oh, don't, don't burn my crotch. Okay. Huh. So now the question... What happens if I put a banana in a flaming hole? Nothing. Potassium makes you go fast, ma'am, so we're gonna give you some speed bananas. 
There we go, go speed racer, na 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 speed racer, go speed racer. Yeah, you need uh, carbohydrates as well, lots of sugars, lots of energy. There we go, leave with more than you bargained for. Trust me, they're not gonna weigh you down. They're very light and flaky. Probably shouldn't let the racing commission see this. I get the feeling she might be disqualified, so we're just gonna... Okay, okay, hold, whoop, whoop, whoop. hold on, hold on, we'll, we'll get there, we're gonna get there. Come on. Just, just close, damn it. There we go, okay. So we have a little bit of spillage, but that's perfectly, ooh, fine. A little bit of fumes. You can use that as a smoke screen though, okay? That's gonna be a, a very useful weapon when racing. Yeah, you should be fine. That's gonna be, uh, ooh. Why did it, did it auto print because the fin of your car hit the button? <laughs> I don't think that was supposed to happen. Uh, yeah, screw it. You know what? Nine grand's good enough. Interesting. <laughs> if you're sure this will work, I trust you. Okay, now it's time to win this race. I'm out of here. Let's go. See ya. Yeah, you've definitely been eating donuts all day. That's a sugar high if I've ever seen one. <laughs> the flaming bananas in the back are great. So she's got a smoke screen. She's got banana peels. The only other thing I could have done is given her a turtle shell. She would have been great. Mmm. Lord donuts. <laughs> Don't judge me! How are you feeling about that, sleazebot? Goods? Yeah, job bot, good? I think we could do better. We could still do more, okay? We're gonna have another customer come in. We're gonna do even more for them. Ooh, you look like you have a little extra already. <laughs> you don't need any more. Oh, hey man. Can you help me clean out my traveling van? It's kind of gnarly in there, and I'm picking up some weird vibes. Want me to clean your car? Weird vibes? What is it, haunted? I don't do exorcisms, ma'am. And I'm also not a gardener, so... That whole flower situation on your head it might be a thing for a doctor. I'm a mechanic, not a maid service. This isn't... Okay. <laughs> Those are some large... St oh! Hey, human. These are legal! Oh, are they now? That's nice. I wasn't gonna smoke it, I swear. They grow back real quick, though, and I can't eat them. Hmm, oh, I have an idea. What if we do a little something like that, right? Yeah, you see, everybody leaves with more than what they came for. We're doing good work. All right, lady, let's see what you're packing in here. A couple slices of pizza, a few soda cans, probably a human hand. Uh, yeah, that, that's not so bad, right? I could dispose of pizza. Yeah, that's easy. Mmm, and the crusts. There we go, okay. I don't know how old pizza needs to be for a robot to want to throw it out, but... It tastes fine. Alright, soda cans. I'm sure I can still copy a few of these. Yeah, boy, there we go, okay. Couple more. Uh, you got anything to help out with the... Smell? The smell? Oh, smell. Yeah, right away, right, right, right away, man. Freaking doors, get out of the way. Uh, that would be in decor, I believe. She looks like a fine pine kind of woman. <laughs> we could just uh, pop that right there. There you go. All right, that's looking a lot better. So, I'm trying to go fully green, man. Could you switch my, um, battery out to something that really vibes with my style? Vibes with your style, huh? Hold on a second, let's just take a quick look. Uh-huh, uh-huh, exactly as I expected. Okay, um, vibes with your style. What does that mean? So you're... Oh! Oh, it's an electric car! Okay! So it doesn't have any fluids or anything like that, it just runs on, on batteries. And she doesn't want to run on Duracells anymore. She wants me to switch it out for a bit of a, a greener way of doing things. So, I'm thinking, uh, flower power? You seem to be into that kind of thing. Maybe some solar as well? 
I'm not sure how she'd feel about nuclear. Yeah, we're just gonna go with more flower power. Uh, well, gotta plug that in. There we go. Is this dirty? That's dirty. Oh, I'm gonna change that out for I you. I love it. It's totally green. I can't do hand gestures in this game, and it bothers me. <laughs> totally, bruh. So, yeah, we're, we're doing pretty well here. I'm not sure if she has enough extra yet. We did make it so she's polluting less. We did make her a little more green. We gave her a hood ornament. Um... What else would she like? Hippies love frisbees. So how about we give her a, a few complimentary frisbees? <laughs> now that I think about it, probably should have put these in the trunk and not in her engine, but it, it'll be it'll be fine. It'll, it'll, everything is fine. Everything is fine, guys. Calm down. <laughs> Okay, no, calm, calm down, everybody. Calm down. Everything is all right. Everything is under control. Everything is under control. Damn it! We have a little bit of leakage, but that's okay. It, it's okay. It's okay. There we go. Okay, she should be good now. We're just gonna, we're gonna put her down. You're polluting. You might want to get a mechanic to check that out. Okay, your car definitely shouldn't be pooping out frisbees, but that's gonna be uh seven thousand dollars, not like hippie dollars or bags of weed. All right, human, that looks good. I'll see what I can do about this bill. Yeah, you see, what, is, is that a tie around your hair? Okay. I think she left most of the frisbees. I've made a bit of a mess this episode. You're going to be the one to clean it up. What happened to my tune skis? It's like as soon as I started singing Speed Racer, they just decided to crap out on me. Okay, that's a little bit better, right? A little bit of ambience, right? We're gonna give everybody as much as we can, because here at Grifty Lube, we care. We guarantee more than what you came for. Oh, you again. I don't think you have a sunroof. How is your hat through your roof? Hey, Sleazebot, I got the car just like you asked. Let's hurry up and get to work before he comes looking for it. Oh, a uh, human. This is a special job. We got to uh, strip this thing down for parts. For for reasons. For reasons, Come on, human. huh? Grab everything you can. Hurry up. Come here. Here I am trying to haul up the reputation of this establishment by the bootstraps, and you're running a chop shop? Is that what's happening right now? So you just stole a car, and now I need to take a bunch of stuff from it. You want me to take eight things from it? Leave nothing behind. <laughs> I've been doing a lot of cop calling in this series, I'm not gonna lie, and you're right at the top of the list. You can share a cell with Granny Bot, just you wait. Four, Batteries five. Are always in demand. We're in the money. We're in the money, okay. Do you want me to just chuck it on the floor? Nice. Those will be easy to resell. Yeah, can't forget the plates. Those are worth something. Didn't I give this to you the last time you were here? Right? I'm pretty sure I uh, tried to frame John Bond. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see here. So you got some stuff in the vehicle that we might be able to grab. A couple of these. Probably not worth Nothing anything. Too small to loot. I like your stuff. Hello, here he comes. Act that. It took me a while to find where you parked my car, valet bot. I never would have expected you to get it tuned up for me like this. <laughs> it's great. Are you done with it? Can I drive it home? I don't know. Are we done with it? Can he drive it home? I'm going to put everything back. I didn't sign up for this, okay? If I'm going to screw with the car, it's going to be on my own terms. You got to leave with more than what you showed up with. So we're going to give him some upgrades. He's going to get a clean air filter and uh, we're going to give him the most expensive doodad that we have. And uh, he, he's going to need a little fluid as well. And then I think he'll be good to go. All right, I'm, I'm pretty sure I've replaced everything. Okay, you're, you're, you're good to go. Everything should be... A free tune-up? <laughs> this is the best valet service ever. I tried my best. Nice job. I'll be back for my share of the earnings later. Yeah, you're gonna be real Let's upset about that. that. Last job, a little bit of personal business. Just pretend you never saw anything, all right? I'm pretty sure parts and labor was like five grand. So am I just not getting paid for that? And are you gonna keep that fancy hat for the rest of the episode? Because that'd be wonderful. 
Not too late for a floor donut job, but if you change your mind and stop being such a spoil sport, did you see that? That always happens when I eat floor donuts. I'll have them face down, which is the proper way, because you want the flavor on your tongue, not on the roof of your mouth. And then when you take a bite, it flips. What kind of witchcraft is this? I see you. You're casting some kind of weird spell on me, you freak. Just, just give it up. God, I'm gonna wing you with something in a minute. Oh God, a Girl Scout. Yeah, did it run over a forest? Oh, you gotta help me, human. I took my dad's car out last night with my friends and now it's a mess. He's gonna kill me. Okay, this won't be too bad. Just clear off those branches for starters. Yeah, all, all right. Listen, dude, I'm sorry I called you a Girl Scout. I've, I've dealt with a lot of Girl Scouts. They look, well, like you. How did you manage to run over a whole forest, but still keep two eggs perfectly intact? <laughs> oh, oh! You, you did that. You, you did that. Okay, that, their deaths are on you. <laughs> that wasn't me. Ah, novelty air freshener looks incriminating. Better remove that too. What does that say? Chips and Bites Casino? Uh, yeah, things look up to par under here. Okay. I don't know. Oh. Eva bought Vegas. Huh. I don't know why this would be incriminating. Ah, uh, uh, okay. I just realized he's totally gonna know I used the car because the mileage counter. Can you do something? <laughs> Classic. I used to do this all the time when I was a kid. Just throw the car in reverse and put the pedal to the metal. Oh. I was wondering why you could interact with that stuff. Okay, so let me see here. We're just going to toss you in reverse. Oh, that's pretty clever. Oh yeah, the tires move and everything. Uh, there's a bit more evidence in the trunk. You think you could get rid of that too? Hmm, evidence, huh? Hold on, I wanna try something real quick. What if we toss you Back into forward, and then, uh... Ooh. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. I am really curious what's gonna happen when I put this car down now. <laughs> what is this? Good times and money? Do anything you gotta do. Just bill me when you're done. I still have my dad's credit card, so... Did you... I, c I can't tell if he ran over a forest or if he went to Vegas and got hookers and blow. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'll, I'll take your money. Yeah, it's floor money now, you can go there with the dead birds and frisbees and stuff. Uh, you know what? I think you're probably good to go? Yeah, I'm gonna say you're good to go because I really want to find out what's gonna happen when I do this. It's honking the horn as well. <laughs> and it hit the print! Okay, here you go. Good luck driving this thing. Oh, thanks, human. I'll get this squared away uh, later. You're the best. Later. Good luck. Mm. Oh, come on. I thought he would, like, plow into the sign or something. That would have been amazing. Well, Jawbot, who's laughing now? You were too good for floor donuts, and now you don't get any floor money. But I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Job Simulator, guys. And I think we still have one episode of the auto mechanic left. And it's like I said, usually the last few levels are the wildest in each of the careers, so... I have no idea what to expect, but I'm gonna leave the decision up to you guys. Would you prefer for me to return and do the last episode of The Auto Mechanic, or would you prefer that I come back and do another episode of Infinite Overtime instead? So be sure to leave a comment, let me know, all that kind of stuff, and I'll return for more Job Simulator soon. But thank you so much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.